Scammers are always trying out new ways to get your information. Now your most used device could be collecting information on you and giving it away without you knowing. WNCT's Emily Gibbs explains. More than 50% of smartphone users drop their phones, causing them to crack, and then they rush to the store to get them fixed. But how many users know that fixing your screen can invite hackers into your device? It's called the chip in the middle attack. Scammers are getting a hold of screen replacements and adding a spyware chip. The sensor reacts to where the touch is. The chip can track your fingerprints to steal passwords or any data you plug into your phone. It can also send you to phishing websites. A recent study say the hackers are specifically targeting people with Samsung devices. The, the Samsung screens have a higher resolution. Why Samsung? It's just higher to re re repair them. We just don't see a lot of them just because, I mean, you get an iPhone screen, you can do them for 100, and then you get a, a Samsung screen, and then it's upwards to 200. The study says the cheaper the price, the greater risk of getting a hacked screen. The Samsungs tend to get a little more difficult. The price is really your big difference. I talked with an employee at Fast Phone Repair about steps they take to keep their customers' phones safe. All our screens are, are, are from uh, reputable dealers in the United States. Uh, we don't do anything outside the United States. You can usually tell if uh, they are a little different. Repair experts say besides staying away from small, unknown screen replacement shops. We do, of course, recommend the tempered glass and definitely cases, protective cases. The scam has yet to hit Eastern North Carolina, but the Better Business Bureau tells me that once it starts in one part of the country, it can easily spread to the next.